On Monday, we told you about parents in the Lee Summit School District whose children will now walk to school because they live within a half a mile of their building. Now, parents in Lee Summit are upset because uh, of or a change to some bus routes. KCTV 5's Abby Dodge talked with parents and the school's transportation department about the change that may mean a longer walk to the bus stop for many kids. When school begins on August 14th, some students in the Lee Summit School District will have to walk a little further to catch the bus. After 10 years of growth in the city, the district is now doing what it calls group stopping, meaning there will be an average of 1,200 feet between bus stops. That's triple what it was for the last school year. By doing that, they've, they've kind of taken away from, uh, uh, you know, our whole neighborhood has, it used to have stops and it had multiple stops, now it has zero stops in it. Their small neighborhood of 37 homes has seven middle schoolers in zero bus stops. The district director of transportation says by making fewer stops, children will spend less time on the bus, bringing the average bus ride from 55 minutes last year to 35 minutes for the upcoming school year. But well, we always ask parents to ask themselves, what can they do to help us? Uh, we need their partnership in doing this. We can't go to every door. If we go to every door, we'll never make to school on time. It doesn't have to be three stops. It doesn't have to stop in front of everybody's house. I understand that's not, you know, time. They have a, a short amount of time to get the kids to school, but do, creating one stop, at least in a neighborhood, makes sense to me. This is the corner where Barry's son caught the bus last school year. It's just right down the road from his house, and the bus stop is a little ways away, so I'm going to start a timer to show you how long it takes us to walk to the other stop. Barry's son now has to walk down this street and this one and across the busy Tudor Road to get to his stop. It took us about three minutes and 50 seconds to walk from the old bus stop to the new one right here. Barry said it's not so much about time as it is the safety of his son. Some of the comments were made that, you know, you could stay there with him in your vehicle. I might as well take him to school if I'm gonna do that. Well, and safety is something we all care about. We do as well, and that's a partnership. We partner with our parents on that. It takes all of us working together. Henry says parents can call the transportation department if they have concerns. He says if there is a serious safety concern, they'll make changes as needed. In Lee Summit, Abby Dodge, KCTV 5 News.